Hey everybody, this is Craig with Cray's Furniture and Antiques. Just kind of wanted to show you inside of our operation. We're a little bit different. I've got 2,000 square feet at uh, Harris Lake Self Storage, uh, and these units are 14 by 70, so we can pack a ton of furniture in here. And we've always got um, both sides completely packed full of super nice stuff. Um, right now I've, I've got like three or four different rows of furniture that we've had piled in here and I've been kind of saving some money on rent by doing it this way. You know, eventually I'd like to get, you know, a real big, nice, fancy showroom, but you know, for now we're, we're working with this and, um, you know, it works out because we can pile a ton of furniture in here. And, you know, we do everything from antiques, like this is a Jacobian oak china cabinet, you know, an, an older mahogany china cabinet. There's a nice Henry Don buffet, baker uh, console table, you know, a French chest of drawers. This is a craft teak piece, which I really like. You know, but we do cherry, lots of solid wood vintage stuff. Um, it's kind of a cool older like kitchen hutch. One of my favorite china cabinets of all times. It's by a company called Wilhelm, but it's got like painted sides on it. It's really cool. You know, the craft teak piece, some dressers. I, I like French. So, you know, here's, here's another French piece, which is cool. A couple older uh, console tables. It's a real cool oak china cabinet. Um, but you know, we kind of have a little bit of an unorthodox setup and, and the fact that, you know, Hey, we're in a, like a storage unit facility, but you know, between these two units, I'm going to take you in the other one as well. You know, it gives us about 2000 square feet. And then I've actually got an overflow unit um, that we use as well. It gives us like another 300 square feet. So, you know, total, uh, you know, we have about 2,300 square feet and I've got just about everything packed. I built these shelves over the summer so that we can put more stuff in here. So I've got stuff piled on top of the shelves, stuff on the bottom of the shelves, you know, couches. We've got tons and tons of beds, real nice dining room stuff. This is another Craftique piece. This is actually an Italian dining set uh, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, but I like Victorian stuff. That's Edwardian error furniture, you know, Victorian couch and a beachy coffee table. I got the matching table to that Wilhelm uh, China cabinet that I was showing you a minute ago. But you know, we do a lot of vintage stuff. You know, I've got a couple of Victorians, but you know, I love like exposed wood. You know, this is an early Thomasville sofa, which is really cool and a Victorian bed, you know, buy it, but I've got poster beds for days. And what you couldn't see in the other one, there's also beds upon beds upon beds, you know, um, behind all of the stuff. This is a Craftique piece as well. And then we've got chairs. This is a cool one, like an old vintage, probably like 60s, 70s chair. And more and more, uh, th this one, the bed behind this chair is actually Lexington furniture and it's an older one, it's like solid mahogany, you know, very comparable to uh, what you'd get from like Craftique or um, Hinkle Harris. But as you can see, we have tons and tons of stuff. I've got, you know, chairs and just about every nook and cranny, you know, jam packed with furniture. So, you know, when you see that, we work out of a little storage unit it's not not really what you typically think of you know as a normal storage unit it's more like a smaller warehouse but again you know we're making do with with the space we have you know we were thinking about moving out uh last year and then covid hit so we kind of put the brakes on that and then you know with the election and you know covid coming back I'm just kind of Kind of waiting to see uh, what happens before you know we get like an official uh, storefront. But um, anyway, that that's a a little brief tour of our facility. Hope you come out and see us sometime.